Hey y'all, it's the costume jeweler. We're at the brand new red, white, and blue thrift store. This is in Riverview, Florida. So come on out here and check it out. This is my first time here. We're going in here looking for purses, jewelry, knickknacks, whatnots, doodads, and trinkets to pack up for resale on my YouTube lives. Those are usually every Saturday about 7 or 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I do shop with me, thrift with me videos every other day. Those are posted. So hit that notification bell, click all, make sure that bell turns white so you're notified of my live sales as well as these video uploads subscribe to the channel and thumbs up for this video so riverview florida is about 20 25 miles from tampa and i've really been spoiled to the two tampa stores so i'm hoping with this new store here that we're going to find some good stuff they've also got one in brandon so now we have four different locations two in tampa one in riverview florida and one in brandon florida it's usually the designer purse superstore so we're gonna see if this one holds up to that reputation like the others do so pretty big purses on the top racks we're gonna check those out first I'm going to check those out first I've always told you the Made in Italy purses, I would get them if I were you. This is Isanti, I-S-A-N-T-I. -A -A it's green in color. A little bit, I mean, not too much of a rub right there, maybe. Good condition. The interior looks good. I don't know, though. It's got that mark right there. They've got, what, about five rows of purses on the top racks. Then they've got a whole wall of purses as well. Let me check them all out. But yeah, I've been just wanting to get over here, and I never have gotten here yet. It's DF. What, well, who is this? First in Berg, I believe. Let's see who this is. Let's see if we can see the tag. So I don't know how popular these this brand is. It's Diane Von First in Berg, and I've seen these before. I love the pink hearts. So maybe patent leather, I guess. Looks like it's pretty good in condition. Well, minus that. Because of the corners, I think I'm going to pass on it. So just like the other stores, they're going to have tons of clothing, if that's your thing. I can't imagine this lady coming in here and all of these different choices that y'all have. I think I would be in one store all day. I'd have to probably go to each store each day, split the time up between them. It's kind of like Second Street. You find these fancy shoes right here size 11 9 west this one I don't believe is leather y'all but this is super cute I'm not going to get it but I just want to show it to you that you got your little honeybee there all your flowers it does not appear to be real leather no designer tag on it, but super cute. Very colorful. Dragonflies and the bees. Rosetti, a discounted rate of $9.99. This bag right here is in excellent condition. Looks like there's no issues on the inside. Love the interior. Custom bags. Christine Detroit. Look at the outside. So I, there's no zipper closure. You can kind of see there. I guess you just, it's like a clutch, a huge clutch. But I don't know, y'all. What do you think? Should I get it or not? It's like new condition. So it's like new old stock. Kind of liking it. Look at that. Probably has not been used. Somebody bought it and just carried it around. I think we may get that one. We've got plenty of room for more. Coach. What is this? An old camera case with a camera in it. It's kind of cool. Chops Ralph Lauren, brand new. Brand new Ann Klein. 
Kind of a peach gold tone. Let's see here, what's this one? Coach again. It's a pretty good looking coach. Probably the most beautiful Rosetti I've ever seen. Look how pretty she is. Comes with your little bag. Bad, bad, bad. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Spartina. Pretty good bracelet selection. There's a lot more here out on the racks than there are other stores. I saw this brand at the last store, Bentley, but I know nothing about it. It's super special or used to be. Is this a beautiful tooled leather wallet? And then I really like the front of it. So this is definitely probably a 1970s pigskin wallet, so I think I'll add it to this one. This one right here I think is made out of recycled material. There's the branding on it. Comes with a number, but you can tell it looks like it's made out of rubber tires, and that's shown y'all purses like that before. And I like this one because it's unique, so I'm gonna pick that one up. It's too unusual not to get. Buxton. Look how nice and tidy this place is. And they have lots of jewelry. I'm seeing lots more than I do at the other stores. Their jewelry jars or bags are $24. Trying to remember who DP is, and I cannot remember that. I'll pass on it. No, thank you. And I'll check this one up here. The other brown one. Brown? Yes, please. Yes. So they've got lots of jewelry here at this place. Lots of perfume and colognes. Used to wear polo. And then look at all these watches. We're not gonna look at each one, obviously. But there's tons of them. And there's sterling silver rings.
And you've got all these bracelets too. So this store, I would say, this store has more jewelry than the other ones. So on the necklace I showed you a few minutes ago, are those earrings, the green ones? I think they're Citrine. Who is DP? Those might be black diamonds right there, y'all. Not sure if they are or not. What do y'all think, black diamonds or not? Uh, not yet. Thank you. They have jewelry back here. 25. Swatch watch. I still have mine from 8th grade. And then they've got their gold too. Not very much gold bracelets. Definitely some gold earrings. And then look at these. Lots of sterling amethyst necklaces. I know it's like we're looking at three at a time, right? Fifteen at a time. That's okay. These are gorgeous. And a pretty big selection of um, necklaces hanging up. So these right here would be for crafting because they're missing the clasp on them. You never know, you might find some real pearls in here. Something super fancy. on this one. Kind of got J. Crew vibes there a little bit. It's a pretty pendant. beads on this one, so all glass beads. Helm 925, y'all, look at these pearls. It's a different kind of clasp, but these are real pearls. Take a look at these. Just in time for Christmas. I don't know what the M25 means. I know the 925 stands for sterling. What about that M before it, if y'all know? Asking to ask a team member for assistance. And handle items with care and for electrical goods. Darlene earrings. Darlene. That's no, Darlene. I've never seen that brand before. Speedy checkout ahead. Kindly remove I like those. From your They're different. I like these too. I wish they were Heads sterling up, silver. I was hoping those kind of that these were Chico's a little bit. WB. If any of y'all like Yves Saint Laurent, I found some earrings, some clip-ons. 
that I'll probably bring to one of the cells at some point that I found in my stash at the house. I don't think these are sterling silver, but aren't they awful pretty? Show you the other purses they have on the wall. Orlandi right there. Not sure of that big tote. Jack George's coach. Dooney. St. John. I'm not sure of the pink one. We're on our way back to the purse wall. But I'm looking at the glassware. Say no to decanters. I already have 15,000 of them, but I still look. You got these Al Salt and Pepper shakers. They look vintage. I find this funny every time I see it. I've got two of these, y'all. Look at this. Please do not disturb our stockers as they refresh our selections or take items. Joan Lee. And you know what I forgot at the last uh, red, white, and blue was the, y'all saw the duck flower vase. It was Hull, H-U-L-L, -L, and I totally forgot to get it. So I don't know if I should have or not. Please keep your children by your side for their safety and to help everyone shop. Maybe. Oh gosh, I forget stuff all the time. I'll sit there and second guess myself and think, well, I'm going to go back and get that. These are cute. Chalkware. Fine. Okay, y'all, let's hit that purse wall. We're going to go do that now. Please do not use or sit on any Por su seguridad y para mantener nuestras exhibiciones ordenadas, por favor no usen ni se sienten en los muebles o equipos de ejercicio. Les pedimos amablemente que reciben asistencia a un miembro de la Gracias por ser compradores considerados. Please do not plug anything in. It's kind of like that other one we saw up on the rack. And real calf hair right on the front, y'all. But I don't know anything about that brand. It's not looking that good. Oh, that's 
some dirt on that or what that is. Always a lot of commentary, y'all. A lot of times I just get into looking at the purses and figure that's what y'all want to do too instead of Joyce Susan, instead of listening to me chatter. condition I think we're gonna get it cute and Betsy Johnson got the kitty cat on there kitty cat unicorn I really don't pick up at the Betsy Johnson's much because at least the ones I've seen are not leather, so I don't really want to do that. So, we've got the Henry Bendel. We've got a wallet, like a recycled wallet. I like that. We have got um, the crocheted. We ain't getting the Rosetti. But I think we've got all we can get, y'all. So, we're going to get out of here. So, it's been fun. This is a nice one, nice store. And again, it can be like any thrift store. You never know. Never know if you're going to get something or not. Never know if you're going to find anything or not. So we're getting out of here. We found a few good things. I like them. What is this here? So the Henry Vendell. I'm getting that one. This vintage tooled wallet. I'm getting that one. This recycled tire wallet. I'm getting that one. And I've got this right here. And we're getting out of here. See y'all later. Thanks for watching. Bye.